Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to hopefully resolve if your keyboard shortcuts and hotkeys are not working properly on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So, a very common issue you might have with your computer or your keyboard are keys perhaps getting a little physically sticky or stuck, you know, when you're attempting to tap on such keys. So something you might want to take a look into is just taking a dry cloth, a microfiber cloth, and just wiping down the keyboard. If you have any rubbing alcohol or that stuff that's safe for computer screens and other electronics, you might want to just lightly wipe off your keyboard and see if you're able to help clean up some of those keyboard keys so that it should hopefully be able to be a little more responsive. If you're having still further issues, something else we can look into here as well, if you open up the search menu, Type in Device Manager. Best results should come back with Device Manager. Go ahead and open that up. You want to expand the keyboard section, so double click on that, and then right click on the keyboard listed under here and select Update Driver. Select Browse My Computer for Drivers, and then select Let Me Pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Select Next, and then close out of here. We do not want to restart our computer at the moment because there's one more thing we want to do first, so close out of here and open up the search menu again, type in services, best match, check them back with services, go ahead and open that up. Now you want to locate the HID, human interface service. So you want to scroll down here. So go ahead and double click on the human interface device service here. And startup type, you want to set this to automatic, and then if the service status is stopped, you want to start the service and then select Apply and OK. And then once it's done, now we're going to go ahead and restart our computer. And there you go, guys. Hopefully at this point your issue has been resolved. And as always, thank you for watching. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.